Hey everybody, it's the coach. This is the NFL on EA Sports. We are just moments away from kickoff, and we've got a good one on tap between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Philadelphia Eagles. I'll be back with you again with scores around the league at halftime. But kickoff right around the corner. And standing by to call the action, here are Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Well, Coach, this city of Philadelphia is one of rich history and passion, and you can always count on the ladder when you step inside Lincoln Financial Field. Nothing like the fanfare of introductions to an NFL game, and that was in evidence a moment ago. Fireworks, pyrotechnics, you name it, this crowd is ready as their guys get set to match up between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Philadelphia Eagles. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, and Charles, you look at this Eagles team as they interplay here. They can't be any better as we hit the halfway mark. A perfect 7-0 on the year. And when we looked at this team in August and we looked at the schedule, we thought they had the potential to get off to a hot start, but I don't think either of us expected 7-0. Meanwhile, for the Bengals here, whatever promise they had to start the season fully evaporated now as they come in losers of six straight. And sometimes when you're in the middle of a losing streak, being on the road is exactly what you want. You can only depend on each other. Let's see if they can use that as fuel in this ball game. Lurching closer toward the midway point of this NFL season, and we're underway on EA Sports. This fielded a few yards into the end zone, and no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes this. out to the 25-yard line. Here come the Bengals now to take over, and they'll be let out by the guy under center, Charles, their quarterback. What I enjoyed this week is that you asked to talk to his offensive center before the game and find out a little bit more about him and what the relationship is. And that was a pretty positive story, wasn't it? Yeah, and really what I took away from that is just how it has permeated throughout the entire offensive line, the relationship they've had. It's really a group that's in sync. They care about him. That's the thing, they really care. And when you care that much, you're going to play that much harder for him and give him a better chance to lead the team to wins. And he gets this one to midfield before he's brought down. They'll get 14 on that one. Good for a bangle first down. And there we see an early burst that makes him one of the leading rushers in the league. Well, I want you to know, I listened to you yesterday when we were watching film. You said right down the word vision for him. It was on display there, wasn't it? It certainly was because he allows the blocks to set up in front of him. And if that continues, it'll be a long afternoon for those guys trying to play some defense. Meanwhile, this one knocked down in the backfield. It's incomplete. After the incomplete pass here now is second and ten. From the midfield strike, they'll look to throw. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Von Miller in there for the sack, and that is now 21 for him on the year. Wow, what a season. Switch up, switch up. Shoot. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And the catch made, it's Tyler Boyd. That's good for 28 yards. We play to win. Let's go. And let's face it, that what we just saw there, not a surprise, is it? I mean, this is what he does well. And if you don't tackle him as soon as he catches the ball, <laughs> this is the end result. Big yardage after it. Got the speed, the agility, so good with run after catch. I'm only in the first quarter, so they better get rush coming, and he's taken down. Von Miller in there for sack number 22 on the year, and folks, that's just a half sack shy now of Michael Strahan's record of 22 and a half set in 2001. And an alley to run. And he'll get this one down to about the 20-yard line. Give him 17 and a Cincinnati first down. And that was a nice, strong run by the guy they call the field general. Mix in with a first down carry. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Bengal TD. Joe Mixon, his fourth touchdown on the year. And the Bengals take it right down and score on the opening drive. 
The losing streak had taken on a life of its own, and I think it infiltrates a team when you're on that much of a slide. But this group has managed to focus, come out early, and put a touchdown on the board. They look, they look like they mean business in this one. They do now the key, holding on to that attitude, because, man, that streak has been a struggle for them. That'll be taken in the end zone. And he'll be brought down at the 23, make it the 24-yard line. Let's go, Wentz and the Eagles now with a first and Let's 10 at their own 24. Let's make great, great. All the way back. Working from the gun, Wentz. Oh, he's going to air it out right away. It's caught inside the 25. And he'll take it into the end zone for an Eagles touchdown. DK Metcalf. 76 yards as his guys are on the board here in this first quarter. Well, you know he can be explosive, and he's ultra-explosive there on the fly route. And you know how many times we've talked to coaches and we've had quoted back to us, well, you know something? When you execute really well, it doesn't matter if they know it's coming or not. But well, sometimes athleticism.